still going to be guided to do things in this world. That's just the gentle way of waking up, of following your internal teacher. I don't think there's a more gentle way that there could be than to listen and follow your internal teacher. That's why the whole course is just aimed at that. Dove quoted from Lesson 189, forget this world, forget this course, and come with holy empty hands unto your God. It's really aiming us to follow our internal teacher. Now people have seen me traveling to these 40-some countries and sharing all the things that I've done over these last 20, 25 years of travel and 30 years with the course, but there's some beautiful ones that came, um, that just kind of dropped into my lap. One time I was down in Argentina and I would go out into the rural areas and they couldn't afford the course down there. These were like a lot of them women with children and they loved the course but they couldn't afford to buy the book. They would have Xerox copies of one chapter and all these women would huddle around at one of the women's house, they invite me to come there, and they would pass around a, a, a Xerox copy of one of the chapters in Espanol, you know, in Cursa de Milagros. And they would, they would read it like they did gold in their hands. And if they couldn't get another copy, they'd do the same chapter over and over and over. Because they couldn't afford to buy the book. So, Jesus was talking to me, and, and after the uh, two or three trips down to Argentina, he said, you know, these people are ready for my course, but they can't afford to buy the book. Because the book's being printed up in the United States. And by the time it gets shipped down to Buenos Aires, there's all these fees, and then to get it out into the rural areas, Argentina's a big country. That one woman actually honestly said, with tears in her eyes, she said, it took me a half month's salary to buy Un Curso de Milagros. Think of that saving up a half month's salary to buy the book. And so, Jesus was speaking to me when I came back, I had all these signs and symbols around me uh, about the, the things that the Bible went through in Europe, and it was coming in very strong. You've got to get the Course in Miracles in Spanish in an affordable way to the people of South America. And so, I went down to Bogota, and I could feel it swirling right after that in my heart, really strong. Jesus was like, here we go. You know, what Jesus says in the Course is, it cannot be difficult to do the, cre the task that Christ appointed you to do, for it is He who does it. He was almost like, watch me. <laughs> watch me get this into the hands of the people in South America. You watch me. I go to a meeting, I meet this guy, Alberto, and uh, I walk up to him and I said, I think we've got something to do with getting a Course in Miracles down here in South America in, in an affordable way, because Jesus is on my heart very strong, he's moving very swiftly here. And he says, great, I'll, it's almost like Helen and Bill, you know, Bill giving his speech, you know, to Helen, there must be a better way, and thinking Helen would laugh at him, and she went, you're exactly right Bill, and I'll help you. <laughs> Alberto, he looked at me and he said, Alberto Mendoza, he said, you're exactly right and I'll help you. In, it took us about a couple years to get the plates from the Foundation for Inner Peace shipped down to a factory in Colombia, rural Colombia, and we had it printed on Bible paper and thousands and thousands, tens of thousands were printed and they were shipped and disseminated all over South America. I even went down to the factory itself where the books were printed. And then, we hopped on a plane and I, and I took a whole box of them over to uh, Medellin. And when I got there, there was a whole Course in Miracles Center in Medellin. And they saw this big box that it took three of us to bring it in and they ripped it open. And it took them 30 seconds to take out all the books. They were so thirsty for Un Curso de Milagros down there. And so, nowadays, can you tell me which book has have been printed and sold the most? The English version or the Spanish version? What do you think? Spanish! Spanish. <laughs> Overtook the English. Jesus is in charge of this plan. He will put that book where he wants it.